And we're back for another episode. In this episode we're going to be doing the level 60 culinarian quest introduced in Stormblood. And as always hello from Mifri. So we are at the culinarian guild in Upper Linza Laminza at 10.8. So let's talk to the guild master. So the quest is called Flavors of the Far East. Uh, Linsgaff has a visitor he would like you to meet. So ah good timing lass. There's someone come calling as wants to meet our most decorated chef. That's you, you daft sod. Uh, your sickening modesty aside, your visitor says he's an adventurer what took up cooking on the side, not like your good self. Um, owing to that, he sees you as something of an inspiration. Any road, be a dear and go and say hello, would you? You'll find him out by the dining area, uh, a brawny sort of bloke, name of Ralph. Okay, let's do it. So where is Ralph? Here he is. I like his outfit. So, by Ralgo, it's really you, the famous Mifri Menafil in the flesh. I first heard about you through your adventuring exploits, and I was already plenty impressed, but then I learned that you were a renowned culinarian besides, and I knew that I just had to meet you. You see, for a time, I was also trying to make my way as an adventurer, and a culinarian both, but it soon became apparent that I was uh, spreading my limited talent too thin. So I decided to kiss the adventuring life goodbye and took up a post at Mr. Wenner's Cafe at Revenant's Toll. The thing is, with or without distractions, it's not as easy to succeed as a chef. It's a crowded profession, as I'm sure you can appreciate, and... If I'm to make a name for myself, I can't be making what everyone else is making. Nay, I need to venture into unexplored territory. To that end, I came up with a brilliant idea. I'd incorporate Far Eastern dishes into our menu and cater to the Dolman residents of Revenant's Toll. Uh, promising, right? Right? The thing is, brilliant idea or no, it's not easy to learn a foreign cuisine. And Far Eastern is just about as foreign as they come. It's plain I'm going to need help, and of well-travelled sort. And so I decided to turn to the most accomplished adventuring culinarian I know, you, Mifri. Now, I realise you're a busy woman, and you've only just... We've only just met. If you say no, I won't think ill of it. But if you'd be so kind as to help out a brother, I'll be waiting for you at Revenant's Toll. Okay. So let's go to Revenant's Toll. Let's see what he has to say for himself and his ideas and so on. Cool. Let's do this. So I do like that we can ground mount a lot quicker now in the old areas. Where is he? Okay, he's not in here. Maybe he's upstairs. Okay, this way. There he is. Okay. So, you, you came. I didn't have my hopes up, but you really came. To have the help of an accomplished culinarian like you is a dream come true. Thank the Twelve, and thank you. Without further ado, let's get right to the cooking. Is what I'd like to say, but I still need to decide a Far Eastern dish to test out. If you could wait a while, I'll look into the Dolmans have hankering for. I have connections, so it shouldn't be too difficult. But until we have a name of a dish, please feel free to go about your business. Again, allow me to thank you for your help, Mifri. It's a great honor to be able to work with the only person in history to score a perfect 10 in the Delmont Dur. Through, I may not be in the same class as you, not even close. I promise to do the best I can to pull my weight. Cool. So, the next culinarian quest will be available from Ralph upon reaching level 63. The requirements for undertaking subsequent quests can be reviewed in your journal. Cool. So, that's it. So, anyway guys, that's it for this episode. Thank you for watching, and as always, goodbye from me, and goodbye from Mifri. Bye guys.